Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for, oh, the new moon, the 24th. So right around the 24th, so we're just going to see what comes up. So the timing is fluid. I know I have to keep saying that because we got a lot of people here that just don't get it. But there is, most of you do, but a lot don't. Um, yeah, so what do we have for around the 24th? What do we have? You know, I, I rewatched yesterday's reading and uh, I got a new a new take on it. I feel like we have somebody here that is holding on to their money. Remember, we saw the Queen of Pentacles right here. It is somebody who is holding on to their money, changing their mind. The Wheel of Fortune, you know, changing, changing their mind, holding on to their money. There's a person underneath that is like, oh my God, I can't believe this. You know, I'm not getting what I thought I was going to get, that kind of thing. Um, so that may be the case. What do we got? What do we got? I mean, the Queen of Pentacles, she's, uh, she obviously, I mean, she's the Queen of Pentacles. And there's a reason why I'm talking about this. She's, she's got the money in her hand. She's holding on to it. She's holding on to her stability, her security. She's she's a businesswoman, right? She's very wise. Not just going to give her money away. Ooh, now this is four of pentacles reversed. Now that is sharing and giving. That is sharing and giving. So they may give some. Maybe, maybe a portion of it. Um... Four of Pentacles. We have somebody here that's been greedy and selfish. Okay. They were greedy and selfish, but now... Um, I don't know. It's time to be practical. You, you, you may have to dig into your savings. Somebody may have to dig into their savings or something like that. Let's get another card. Maybe it's let go of an obsession. Somebody may have been very greedy and selfish and obsessed with money, and you got to let go of that obsession. Ooh. Ah. So, yeah, we have the Emperor reverse. Now, this is a ma Emperor is a very masculine energy. This is somebody who doesn't care. This is somebody who deserts you in the time of need. Um, this is somebody who is corrupt. Okay, the emperor in rever reverse is a corrupt leader or a boss or somebody that is not interested in helping you. They're only out for their own good. And this person appears to be selfish. <laughs> so it looks like we have somebody here that was only looking out for themselves. They were hoarding or being selfish, being greedy. So yeah, we have a greedy individual here that it deserts you in the time of need. This is somebody who does things that are against the law, that doesn't take responsibility, that doesn't follow through, that feels entitled, but really um, isn't. I think we have a selfish individual here who um, is very manipulative uh, I just want to say selfish. Very, very selfish. Only out for themselves. Looking for money. Looking for money. Um, now this is a... Looking for a profit. Looking to make a profit. So we have a selfish individual who is looking to make a profit, but in the wrong way. Okay, this guy, he, he's probably going to get angry because something doesn't go his way. This is about a profit. Um, what can I get out of this? Ooh, five of wands reversed. And the five of wands reversed is... Somebody may get exhausted. There could be a battle. 
okay? There could be somebody that is exhausted. They're sick of playing games. This guy is, is like always ready for battle, but he may get himself into a situation where it feels like he loses. It feels like he's going to lose the battle. Um, this is a card of doing the right thing. I mean, this is somebody who is very skilled as well. So we do have a masculine. We do have a masculine that is very skilled. And this it may be skilled at manipulating. Okay? He's skilled at something. He's skilled at playing games. Hmm. He's a natural. He's a natural. So we have this masculine that is a natural. Something to do with money here. Uh, you know, it's almost, it feels like, um, I was going to say thieving. Um, three of Cups. Oh, it is thieving. Ah, yeah. So we have this masculine or uh, somebody that is very selfish. It may not be a masculine, but I really feel like it is. Could be a female. It could be, but this this is somebody that is very skilled, looking to make a profit, looking to make a profit off of somebody else's hard work. This six of pentacles reverse. This is not giving. Okay, somebody has abused some generosity. This is an abuse of generosity, and now it's being taken away. It is. Somebody, it's like, and now there could be a big, huge financial loss. Six plus four is a Ten of Pentacles, both in reverse. So there's a, somebody may be experiencing a financial loss because of their selfishness. Very selfish. Um, could be a family member. Could be a friend. This person... Um, may go overboard in some way. This is a rejection, lack of reciprocation, and abuse of generosity. There's a one-sided situation here where it's like this guy is entitled. He's entitled to receiving some sort of money that, you know, I think it's from, it could be a family member or a friend or something like that. Somebody that he's in some sort of relationship with. And there's all kinds of relationships in this world, but this is not getting what you thought you were going to get. Somebody's not going to get what they thought they were going to get. There could even be a, a fire. Somebody could get fired. Okay. This could be a boss that is pissed off. This could be a boss that is very pissed off. He is about to, um, oh, it could be let somebody go. Now this is fighting, sparring, the five of wands reversed. Some sort of controversy here over money. There's a controversy over money. This is somebody that, you know, hard work pays off, but you got to put in effort. So we have this boss up here that is probably upset. Probably going to get very upset because somebody just isn't doing what they said they were going to do or something like that. Hmm. Three of Cups. That Three of Cups is usually a card of celebration. Socializing. Communicating. And, and this is a gift. So, so this is a gift. Somebody, and this is uh, abuse of generosity. So it's like somebody was giving, and this is giving. Somebody was trying to give a gift, trying to be nice. And now there's an, been a, an abuse of that kindness, abuse of that generosity. So it's like this person was trying to be nice and give and share their money, share their abundance. But there's now there's an abuse of it. There's abuse of generosity here. This guy is going to get pissed. Put it that way. When you get the emperor in reverse, this is somebody who is lazy. This is a tyrant, somebody that is entitled, and when they don't get what they want, they get very, very, very upset, and this does have to do with money. So I think we have this person that is going to get upset over a financial um, situation. 
there's been an abuse of power or abuse of generosity here. Somebody may get fired. They may get fired because they're a fraud. Okay? There's been an injustice. There's been an injustice here. There has. So somebody did not treat another person fairly. It's over. It is. It's over. So there's been a betrayal. Somebody has been betrayed. Somebody's kindness and generosity has been uh, take. Somebody's been taken advantage of. Put it that way. But this is the end. Okay. This is the end of it. There's been some sort of bitching as well. Friends or bitching behind somebody's back. Gossip. Okay, this is bitching, gossip, talking, communicating behind somebody's back. So somebody has been talking behind another person's back. Hmm. Somebody has gone as low as they can go. It's almost like they've stolen money, right? They abused uh, somebody's kindness. They took somebody's kindness for weakness. And now, <laughs> and now there's going to be a loss, okay? The Six of Pentacles is a loss, maybe even a loss of friendship. This could, this could be the end of a friendship, the end of a relationship, okay? Because somebody abused another person's generosity. They abused another person's kindness. This is the end. It's over. Somebody has done the worst. This is the worst. It's like this is the, this is the you think about it, this is the straw that broke the camel's back. So this is the end. It's like somebody has has done the ultimate. They've deceived a person over money. They've you know money got in the way of the relationship. Somebody I saw that six of cups reversed. Um, somebody is being freed from their obligation. Okay, they're being let go. Somebody is being let go. I don't need you around anymore. A decision is about to be made. It is. Somebody is looking at another opportunity that is better suited. Something more practical, more realistic. Somebody that is more uh, genuine. So that we, It looks like we have somebody here that is focused on something better, somebody that is more skilled, more safe. They're looking at a safer option. They're making a decision. So it is the moment of decision. So they're, they're choosing, they're choosing to, looks like this person is looking at a new, building a new relationship or giving their money to somebody else because this person abused them. This is like gossip. I think somebody, this is like gossip or bitching or something behind somebody's back and it hurts. Somebody, you know, hears about it. This is a sudden, this is a, something happening very fast. All of a sudden, a sudden uh, decision, a sudden choice. There's two choices here. What should I do? There, there's like a business partnership here with this two of one. There is, there's a business par partnership that is coming to an end. It's coming to an end because somebody uh, didn't do what they said they were going to do. Or they abused. They, they This was abuse. This was some sort of financial abuse. You know, uh, they abused somebody's kindness, somebody's gift. Okay, they abused it. Now, there's, there could be a fight. There could be an argument with the five of wands. Okay. Looks like we have somebody here that is noble and somebody that is very uh, genuine and realistic. We may have somebody else that is impulsive. This is a very impulsive energy, but this is things happening fast. Somebody is, is taking action right now. They are making, it's almost like an instant decision. Okay, they're making an instant decision 
based on their own security, their own stability. And then this is like holding on. This is holding on to your own stability, holding on to money. So I do feel like we have somebody here that is going to be, you know, making a practical decision to hold on to their money. Hmm. Seeing clearly, somebody is is seeing clearly now what they need to do. It's like they've been bamboozled. Somebody was bamboozled. They were bamboozled by this extravagant opportunity that looked really, really, really good. Now they see clearly that they need to make another choice. That they need to hold. They see clearly that they need to hold on to their money and not be impulsive. Okay, so this is seeing clearly. Being clear of the choice. There's definitely an, a, a decision that is being made. A choice is being made. And it's clear. It's clear. It's like they, you clearly know that somebody betrayed you. It's clear that you were betrayed by this person, by this friend or this family member. It's very, it's clear. It's clear that they abused your generosity. Now this is about um, letting go. Letting somebody go. Somebody's being let go. They're being removed from, released from their obligation. A choice is being made. And I think it happens all of a sudden. This person may be clearing something up. We may have somebody that comes in and clears something up, brings some sort of clarity. Ooh, somebody's going down. They're going down. Something didn't materialize, a lack of growth, a lack of, uh, of excitement. There's no desire to keep going here. Weighed down. Somebody has been weighed down. Or they're being weighed down. There is going to be an ex permanent loss. Okay. A permanent loss here. The tower reverse is more extreme. Okay. That's extreme. Somebody has taken extreme measures. All of a sudden too. Very A lot of sudden energy. Sudden, sudden, sudden. Su there's sudden. A lot of sudden energy. So something is. All of a sudden. Somebody decides to. Hold on to their money it looks like. Or hold on to their stability. They choose something else. All of a sudden they. Because of that seven of cups. Up there, all of a sudden they see something differently. All of a sudden, they uh, decide to go in a different direction because there's no uh, growth here. There's no stability here or there's no future here, okay? So I feel like somebody decides to just go a different route and it happens all of a sudden. So I'm not sure if we're dealing with an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We could be dealing with a Scorpio. Um, could be dealing with anybody, really. But I think there could be a... Uh, you know, all of a sudden, this could be somebody showing up. Somebody could show up all of a sudden. Um, they've been weighed down for a period of time in some sort of falseness, okay? And something happens. Something uh, ends. There's been, This is the end of a false... Uh, the sense of security, a false foundation. There is definitely... Um, some extreme behavior here with the tower reversed. This is this is a fight. I think we're gonna some. There's gonna be a fight. I think there's going to be a fight that changes everything. It happens all of a sudden. This is when you get the reversed tower. You never saw it coming. It's like somebody's going down. Okay, somebody is is definitely going to be. I mean, obviously this person is down as well. This is down and this is down. All of a sudden, somebody, you know. Uh, The shit is going down, whatever that means to you. Um, they lose their ground or uh, 
they clearly see that there's no opportunity for stability here. They they do. They see they see clearly that you know you can't you can't build up something that is false. So whatever this is, there's there's some sort of clarity that comes to somebody that suddenly moves them in a new direction. And it's because oh, they can't be weighed down by this anymore. They can't be weighed down. I feel like there's going to be, um, I think there's going to be a fight, okay? I think there's going to be a fight or an argument that ensues that uh, may cause an uproar, okay? There could be an uproar. This is a painful change. Um, get prepared. Get prepared for... Um, This is get prepared for something to arrive, something that you have been waiting for. Um, and all you can do at this point is hope and pray for the best. Something is arriving and it may be, you know, what you asked for or, or it may not be. But this is what's in your future. The past is being left behind because this is the past and that's the future. So somebody is is uh, stepping into a new future for sure. And there's there's just something that happens very suddenly that pushes this person forward. Um, things are about to change, and they're, it's going to be a drastic change. It is going to be a drastic change. All of a sudden, somebody decides to take action. They're done thinking about it. They're done thinking about it. They may have been planning it. They may have. They may have been planning it. They may have been in a situation that uh, they were just in it for the money. They were just in it for the stability. They were in it for, yeah, the money and the stability. And they, they realized, because this is realizing the Seven of Cups, that that is a false sense of security. Okay? So, and they just decide to leave. They, you know, because it looks like somebody's deciding to leave. There's no more excitement here. There's no more growth. There's... There's, you know, I can't do this anymore. It's, it's too dark. It's too dark. There's too much darkness here. Um, now this could be light at the end of the tunnel. So I'm not sure what is going on. I feel like, I feel like there's a sudden, uh, departure or a sudden entrance from somebody. All of a sudden it's, it's, it's here, whatever that means. All of a sudden, this is what you've been waiting for. It's here with the three of wands. The waiting is over. Okay, what you've been, it's over. The waiting is over. So the waiting is over. Um, I think there is some sort of argument or fight that, uh, you know, it's the straw that breaks the camel's back. And it causes somebody to... Uh, depart put it that way um it's like the, it's like they get this clarity they get that they know they know that they have to go they know that this is this is unstable it's insecure this is this could be extreme health problems as well so i'm not somebody is this is a lack of of vitality so somebody's health is declining their health is declining it is and this is reaching rock bottom. So somebody is reaching rock bottom. And this is somebody who is corrupt. Okay. This is a father or a husband or a masculine or somebody that um, does things that only in regards to themselves. It's like all they care about is themselves. Very greedy and selfish. This individual... Um, I feel like this individual is going to experience a loss. I do. And it does have to move, do with money. It's big, 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 big financial loss. It's like the universe says it's time. This is the moment of decision. It is time. Whatever that means. I just want to keep saying it's time. It's time. It's time for you to see. It's time for you to see. Somebody has a, has has abused their abused a gift or abused somebody's generosity. They've abused their power, and whoever has done this is definitely going down. 
They are. They're going down. And I think they're going to hit hard. So be prepared to hear about it. Be prepared to hear about it. Be prepared to uh, hear about this fall. This person is clueless. They are ignorant. Okay? They're ignorant. This is a know-it-all. And this may be somebody rushing in. They're looking for a fight. They're looking for a fight. They're a bully. They're explosive. Um, somebody that is rude. Doesn't care who they hurt. I feel like this person is going to be stopped right in their tracks. There is definitely going to be a fight. There is going to be a fight. I know, but I know it. I'm positive. So... We have the end of an agreement. This is the end, and this was an agreement of some sort. Contract. It was built on false pretenses. Somebody is, is clearly seeing that they need to choose another option, and they do so instantly, whatever that means. Somebody is being fired or they're becoming unemployed. There's some sort of theft. Somebody is like robbing. They've robbed somebody. Or they just didn't treat them with uh, respect. There's been some in inequality. There was, there was somebody that abused somebody's charity. And now this person is going down. Good luck. 